everybody, Pokemon Trainer Rob here. Welcome back to the Pokemon Stadium playthrough. Today we're going to Erica's Gym in Celadon City, the Celadon Gym. Known for its grass types. We have a Lass, a Beauty, a Cool Trainer, and of course, Erica herself. Now, during my Pokemon Blue Let's Play, this was uh, Helmarok's Roosting Den. He completely obliterated Erica's team and every single trainer in the gym that went, went along with her. I don't see that happening in Pokemon Stadium, just due to the fact that we have other trainers with other Pokemon, but who knows, maybe we can get the same results out of uh, Helmarok for Erica. Let's see, first we have Jigglypuff, Wigglytuff, Eevee, Cubone... A lot of normal types here. Uh, well, let's bring out Swim Kirby, uh, Madam Puff, and... Helmarok, yeah. We'll go with Helmarok. Here's the first opponent of this gym series. A decisive victory is expected. Okay. I'm not too worried about this because, yeah, frickin' Swim Kirby's a fighting Pokemon, and it's gonna be awesome to take out these normal types. Especially when critical hits are involved, it's always nice. Only Pokemon I'm going to have trouble with, if it appears, is probably going to be that one. But even then, yeah, I'm sure I can handle it. Just a frickin' Paris, after all. Reflect. What are you going to do with armor? You're a frickin' frickin' mushroom bug. Oh, either way, it is resisting my blows, so maybe I should switch. The only app after this, definitely. Spore, I believe, is the only 100% effective uh, sleep move of the Pokémon series, which is really frickin' annoying because that could cause some major problems if used in the right way. But I'd rather just take out this thing for good, so... Let's just use it. No, I meant to use Drill Pack. Use Double Edge. Oh, it works either way. Final Pokemon is probably going to be Wiggly Tough. Yep. Oh, it has over 400 HP, like mine. I could do a frickin' uh, Wigglytuff versus Wigglytuff, but... Eh, let's uh, stick with uh, Helmrock for right now. We'll use Drill Peck. Oh, wow, yeah. Neither one is an Jeez, that freaking drill pecked it over oh, almost 400 damage. It was more like uh, 391, but close enough. Okay, well that takes care of that one. That one wasn't too bad. again, though, I can't get too overconfident. We saw what happened in Surge's gym. I still never want to speak of that ever again. Okay, Celadon Gym Leader 2. Let's see, we have... Oh, a dragon. We have a water, water, bird, bird, stone, dragon. This is going to be a tough one. 
let's go with Helmarok, and then we'll uh, bring Madam Puff and I guess Mega. Hopefully we get the water Pokemon out of the way first. But nah, okay, I think we're gonna be fine. Yeah, that was definitely not a good one to start with. You have a dual type like Rock and Ground, which is, you know, pretty much the same basic ability. You probably don't want to start with that one, because you won't really get a chance to do much of anything. Yeah, I probably would have started with maybe Dratini there. I mean, it still died quite easily, but I think it would have actually had a better chance. Okay, what do we have? Seeking again? I remember battling you earlier. The battle has become one sight. Building energy for the next attack. Oh god, Ice Beam. Oh good, it didn't freeze me. That's all I ask. I don't want it to freeze me like that one battle. Okay, well, there's a second one down. I gotta admit, these trainers are getting tougher because they are mixing their teams pretty well. That is when things are gonna get more difficult. Okay, this one looks interesting. We have... Ground, two normals, two poisons, and one flying bug. Flying bug? No, grass bug. Uh, hmm. I'd say start with me, bring Sunnyside, and Helmarok for backup. Okay, yeah. Uh, this is gonna be a great start for me. Although frickin' Chan- Oh. Bye. Chansey with its frickin' 600 HP. That's gonna be fun to take down. Yeah, what do you expect? You switched to something that was completely vulnerable. Or invulnerable. Yeah, we need to go to Helmrock here. I don't think uh, my other two Pokemon could really do much with it. Oh god, Solar Beam. Well, that's fine. There's no way it's freaking faster than... Dodrio. Yes, it is. In fact, it's dead. Okay, we're gonna get Chansey now. Oh, uh, now we have the Marowak. Well, it's completely restricted from using ground moves, so let's have some fun. Oh wow, they... she gave her Marowak Ice Beam too! She's copying me! You little cheater! Savage hit. 
See, I guess I'm not the only one who thought giving it Ice Beam was a good idea. Computer AI does it too! Well, either way, I'm done getting hit with ice, so can we finish you off and be done with this? I think so. Okay. Chancy! With your 664 HP, this is gonna be fun. Uh, well, it's Drill Peck. I'm gonna keep using Drill Peck, because Drill Peck does have that chance to critical hit. Plus, apparently Chansey is very weak defensively anyway. Okay, that works for me. Well, I guess it's time for the gym leader then. Erica, I have a little friend to uh, reintroduce you to. You remember Helmarok, don't you? Not just Helmarok, I have a new friend for you to play with too, Fire Kitty. And, uh. Oh, well, uh, Sunnyside for some reason. Mostly because most grass types are poison types too, so. Yeah. Okay, here we go! <laughs> Let's do this! Let's do it like we did before! Gonna use the same basic strategy too. Oh god, yes. Helmrock's gonna strike again. This is a wild one from the word go. Oh, it's victory back. We are so gonna do this again. The Pokemon are entirely different types. Yes, we are! Helmrock does it again! I know we have one more left, but even if we do not get a perfect game here, it's still cool. Bloom, why didn't you use Vile Bloom? That was stupid. The remaining Pokemon count is 3 to 1. The battle has become one sided. Yes! Helmarok, the destroyer of grass types. Ah, oh, yes. That's two freaking gems of Celadon City that Helmarok has completely owned the gym leader on. It's good to have a Pokemon like him on my side. Yeah, there we go. We got the uh, Celadon Gym Batch, and... Well, um, I don't have much else to say. We got the key to Koga's Tower. But, I'm actually going to be going back to the Prime Cup next time. So, we're going to do an uh, Ultra Ball of that, and after that, I'll probably return here again. So, I'll see you guys next time for Prime Cup. I hope you guys enjoyed, and this has been Pokemon Trainer Rob saying, see you Star Warriors next time. Later, folks.